Hey there everyone, my name is Ash and this is 10 things we didn't know last week. Number 10. Some genes carry on working after we die. Now this is quite spooky actually because there's always been the question of is there life after death? With um, this research actually does answer that question and that's a yes. Now researchers have discovered that an animal's gene can live on for up to four days after its body has died. Um, some genes including ones that help create an embryo and others associated with cancer even turn on and become more active after death. Now the research could potentially help reduce the increased risk of getting cancer after transplant and also help forensic scientists work out when a murder victim was actually killed. Number 9. Number nine. Elderly monkeys choose to have fewer friends. Now we have known for decades that older people are generally less sociable than younger people. A team of scientists at Leibniz Institute for Primates in Germany found that some monkeys do the same. They found that elderly monkeys, around 25 years old, spend less than half as much time grooming as a 5-year-old adult would. Number 8. Every sperm whale descended from one female whale from about 80,000 years ago. The researchers analyzed mitochondrial DNA from 1,633 whales and found that deep within sperm whale's DNA genes passed on from mother to child lie connection to a single Eve-like whale from about 80,000 years ago. As some of Earth's largest mammals, they have the largest brain of any creature on the planet and can weigh up to 45 tons. But it turns out the most impressive secret of these huge animals are found in something much smaller. Number 7. Seven. Trevor Nunn has directed every one of Shakespeare's plays. A Midsummer Night's Dream at the New Wolseley Theatre marks Trevor Nunn's completion as a director of the entire Shakespeare camp. That is a record on match in the theatre of history. Number, Number six. six. Red kite birds in Scotland have been caught red-handed stealing skinny dippers underwear to make their own nests. Now, unsuspecting swimmers have been left baffled by the disappearance of their underwear, but a gamekeeper found that evidence in the bird's nest, a selection of socks and a pair of navy underpants. This actually isn't the first time the animals have been caught red-handed in stealing any items of clothing. In 2012, a Bedfordshire cat became a minor celebrity after stealing clothes and other items from the neighbors. Number, Number five. 5. Heavy exposure to Disney princesses makes little boys more likely to share their toys and little girls more likely to have stereotypical attitudes about gender. We see them everywhere with a tiny waist, high cheekbones and fancy dresses. Disney princess toys are everywhere from Frozen to Tangled to the Sleeping Beauty and they could influence the way your child grows up. The study of nearly 200 kids found nearly all of them knew about Disney princesses. 96% of girls and 87% of boys had consumed some form of princess citric media. Number, Number four. four. Some female bears use humans as bodyguards. According to a new research, mother bears in the wild are using humans as bodyguards to protect their cubs. It seems that some clever mums have figured out that humans can help to safeguard their cubs against other bears. Some adult male bears kill cubs that he has not fathered in order to free the female to mate with him. It appears that mothers fear dominant males of their own kind more than they do from humans. Number, Number three. three. The world's oldest payslip turns out to be a beer token. It may come as no surprise to us that the earliest known example of writing features two basic human concerns, alcohol and work. A tablet excavated from the city of Uruk in modern-day Iraq, dating back to about 5,000 years ago, is known to be the world's oldest payslip as a beer token. Number, Number two. two. Albania awards diplomatic passports to its international football team. Albania says it will reward its national football team with diplomatic passport for having beaten Romania 1-0 at the Euro 2016 tournament. 
The country has never played before in a major football competition and with losing their two other matches, beating Romania managed to secure the team an extra $1 million in funding as well as new passports for the team. Number 1 And at number 1 this week, a new study in Germany has shown that listening to a soothing Mozart symphony can lower the blood pressure as much as cutting salt from your diet or exercising. Scientists played Mozart's symphony, dances by Johann Strauss, a song by ABBA, to 60 volunteers monitoring their blood pressure before and after the experiment. They found that Mozart lowered systolic blood pressure by 4.7 millimeters of mercury, dances by Johann Strauss lowered systolic blood pressure by 3.4 millimeters of mercury, whereas the Swedish pop group ABBA made no significant difference at all. So I would suggest if you're trying to relax and lower the blood pressure there, listening to ABBA is definitely the wrong choice. Thank you for watching this week's episode of 10 Things We Didn't Know Last Week. Don't forget to subscribe, like and comment and stay tuned for our next episode right here, same time.